Welcome back everyone. So today I am showing you how I did these nails. It is Breast Cancer Awareness Month and Madam Glam is partnered with survivingbreastcancer.org to support Breast Cancer Awareness Month. So if you want to check out their pink collection for every bottle that Madam Glam sells in the pink collection they will donate a dollar all throughout the month of October. So the first color that I'll be using on my nails is from the Think Pink collection and and it is called Gossip. I will have the link to where you can get these polishes from down in the description of this video as well as my 30% off coupon code but make sure you click the link in order to use my coupon code. So I'm going to be doing two coats of this color on three of the nails. Now you can see this color is so opaque I could almost get away with doing one coat Madame Glam really has wonderful polishes that are such great coverage. So I should tell you a little bit about myself. I am a cancer survivor myself. Now I did not have breast cancer, but I had a rare aggressive thyroid cancer and it's 10 years this year that I have been cancer free. So I don't say it a lot, I don't talk about it a lot, but I feel wonderful and everything is good. And I think anybody that supports anything to do with cancer and helping out with that, I think it's a great cause. So thanks to Madam Glam for doing this every year. So now when I was choosing this design, I did have a little help. I am taking the inspiration from, I hope I pronounce this right, Dinoff Six Designs. You can find her on Instagram and I even think she has a YouTube channel, but I will put her link down in the description. But she did a really pretty set on her mom using colors that are quite similar. So you'll see similarities in this design. Just a little bit of a twist, of course, with it. It's a little different, but she gave me the inspiration, so I want to make sure that everybody knows that's where I got the inspiration from. So now I'm doing the second coat on the nails of course and then I'm going to be showing you another color from the Think Pink collection that I'll be using on this set in a minute.
The next color is just a really pretty soft pink and this one is one of my favorites of the lighter ones and this one is called All Natural and it pairs really nice with gossip so I'll do the next two nails in this and of course just two coats because again great coverage. first layer cured I'm doing that second coat and then I'm going to be doing some stamping and of course these are breast cancer awareness themes so we definitely have to do some breast cancer awareness stamping so I'll show you the plate here right away when I'm done that second coat. So the stamping plate I'm using is from the Born Pretty store and of course it's a breast cancer awareness theme plate so perfect for what I need it for. So I'm just going to grab some stamping polish from Born Pretty also and I'm mixing some white with that pink just because that pink's a little bit off from the color of my nails. So I just want to add that little bit of white to it. You'll see me doing that just to soften that pink a little bit. So as you can see, I transferred a little bit of the plate onto my nail that I didn't want. So I'm just going to take some acetone and wipe that off. Now when I'm looking at the ribbons and I've got the rest of the extra stamp removed off it, I notice I need a little bit more of the ribbon down below. So once I get it fully wiped, I'm going to add some more ribbons.
So I added a little bit more ribbon than I wanted and the reason is I'm going to be adding some transfer foil to the bottom and the top of this nail. So again I'll just take some acetone to remove it and just make sure I don't mess up any of the stamp that I already have on there that I want. So I'm just going to apply some transfer foil gel to this whole nail and then it's going to cure. Now I could have just applied it at the very top and the very bottom but I just wanted to cover up that stamp in case I do get some foil where I don't want it then I'll be able to wipe it and not wreck the stamp that I've already done. So I did transfer some of that transfer foil up where I didn't want it. So again, I'll just take some acetone and wipe it off. And like I said, it was covered by the transfer foil gel, so it's not going to wreck the stamp in any way. So I'll just kind of wipe where I don't want it. And then I'll do the top of the nail as well by the cuticle with the foil again. So I'm going to be adding some gold powder to this nail. So I'm taking my Madame Glam No Wipe Top Coat and of course it's going to cure for 60 seconds so I can apply the powder and the powder I'll be using is from Madame Glam and it's called Estella. It's a really nice gold. So once the nail is done curing I'll be rubbing it in and just firm pressure to rub it in and like I said it's just a really pretty gold once it goes on. You'll see that once I'm done. So to one of the pink nails I do want to add some gold lines. Now this is called It's Not You, It's Me and it is not from the Think Pink collection. It is separate but I just wanted to use it to complement the gold on the pinky. So I'll draw a couple lines and cure that once it's done. So I decided I wanted to mat four of the nails so I'm just adding that matte top coat right now to them and then once I get that done I'm going to be applying some pearls and some microbeads.
So before I apply the pearls and microbeads, I'm just gonna top coat this nail. I want this one to remain shiny, so I'll do that first. So I'm just adding some nail glue to the nail, of course, and then I'll add those pearls and the microbeads. They're in rose gold, so I'll just let you guys watch me do that. So now that I'm done adding the pearls and microbeads, I'm just gonna top coat with my matte top coat. And remember everyone that if you buy any of the polishes, there's a whole lot of them from the Think Pink collection. Madam Glam will donate a dollar for the month of October. So definitely check them out. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. I love how these breast cancer awareness nails turned out. I think they're so pretty. And of course I had some inspiration, but love them. So thanks everybody for watching. And if you could like and subscribe, that'd be great. And I will see you guys all in the next one.